93.9 WKYS Marky Mark, who you with? And I got the talented, the beautiful. She get it from her mama. Hey, Miss hey. Victoria Mona, how you doing today? Thank you so much. I'm good. How are you? Man, I'm blessed. Welcome to DC. Thank you. Welcome to Brockett City Festival. I love it here. Yes, ma'am. So you've been all around the world. You've been doing your thing. You just <laughs> yeah. been traveling, just living your best life. So yes. take it back to the beginning. Ooh. Not too many people can sing and dance. When is that moment that you realize I got the whole package? I can sing, I can dance, I can do it all. You know what? I actually studied them separately. I started as a dancer. Yes, ma'am. And then I discovered that I love writing and, and singing. And so eventually I put them together. But originally it was just like two separate ventures that I, I just really enjoyed. Yes, man. Look yeah. how God worked. You started off in this lane and that was needed. So now when you add the singer aspect, you we able to get on together. stage <laughs> and do your thing. And yes. that's so great about your performance that you actually actually perform yeah, so when you, you get on these stages and you about to hit the stage tonight everybody's waiting yes. for you what's some of your favorite songs to perform uh right now i really love all right um there's the choreography makes me feel really uh it's like there's masculine energy but also feminine energy so i love that fluidity within the choreography i also love on my mama because a lot of people know that song so it just gives gets the people going that's you know? all our jam you hear me we <laughs> yeah. all get it from my mama so yeah. what do you think is the best thing you learned from your mama growing up and the best thing that helps you you know be able to go through life and chase your dream what's the biggest thing she's inspired you to do and just make you just chase your dream um i feel like it's work ethic for my mom um she was speaking of masculine and feminine energy yeah. i grew up with a single mom and so she was handling hey, it that all. single mom love you got two seconds i say can't the room when i go down and come back Clean. It better be clear, you hear me? <laughs> exactly. So speaking of motherhood, your mom <laughs> and your daughter's following, and she was yeah. a Grammy nominee. How does that feel for that to transpire? And like, you know, you got it from your mom, and she getting it from her mom, and she being great just like you. It's legacy, it's lineage, and it means so much to me, and I want to keep it going. Honestly, I feel like I feel for my second child, because I'm like, woo. <laughs> it's going to be some big shoes to feel, right? <laughs> yeah. Yes, man, yes. I, I could predict it. Now I want to take you back to a second. BT Awards. Yes. We've all been inspired somebody. How did that how did that phone call feel when you was like, I'm gonna be a part of Usher's tribute at BT Awards? And how did that all come together and then to work with so many phenomenal ladies? And you are a part of the phenomenal lady club. How does that <laughs> the feel? Phenomenal lady I just club. Made it up, right? I love it, that. Yeah. That's a great Around name. The language, we need bingo. the jackets. Phenomenal yes, Lady Club. Um, it was an amazing uh feeling and I was just I took it really seriously. And that's so I think that's what you saw transpire on the stage is just someone who really wanted to honor that person in the right way they deserve that um and me and tiana had a great time that was super too, dope so i feel I like we stood up for the women yeah hey ladies yeah. is where it's at now <laughs> two more questions before we get you out of body here jaguar 2 yes we playing all your hit singles like how, what's the motivation behind that project and where you want to get your listeners and fans to come from that album from you um i think that jaguar 2 is about um going for exactly what you what you want and being unapologetic and unafraid to do so even if it's been dark for most of the journey that you know that light is coming and so that's what i want people to feel when they listen to jaguar 2 is no matter what the emotions you feel currently are you see light at the end of that tunnel and you get to bite and and pounce and get exactly what you came for and it's coming it's coming hey look it better to be <laughs> jaguar than cougar too you hear me all right <laughs> Cool, before we go, I got a hip hop boom box, right? Okay. And once you turn this boom box on, these three things will come true for your career, your personal life, or anything that you want. So when you turn this boom box on, what do you see for Victoria Monet? Um, happiness. Happiness. Success. Success. And creative freedom. And creative freedom. Yes. Yes, man. There you go, Miss Victoria Monet. <laughs> she gonna kill the stage here at Brock hey. City Fest. You see the wardrobe? That's that. Hey, man, you hear me? Hey. Comfy swag. <laughs> we lit. Right. Hey, listen, man. <laughs> Anything you want to say to me before let them go? This radio, um, TV, or radio, all yours. Yes, I want to say that I love you. If you're supporting me, thank you so much. If you're new here to, to my support, I appreciate you. And let's ride this thing together. Hey, Jaguar 2, <laughs> you better get it all let's right. Go. Everything's all right around the way. You hear me? I'm with Victoria <laughs> Monet. Down on all that follower. She got to go. She about to kill a stage because they about to kick me out, man. Walking my queer, Brogan City Theft. What's your let's least favorite go. vegetable? My least favorite. I can tell you my least favorite fruit. That was random. Oh, you got least favorite fruit? Yeah, cantaloupe. I ain't worried about you. So out of arrangements, don't send you to. Don't send no you to. No cantaloupe, that. please. And no honeydew, actually, either. Those two, watermelon with lemon squeezed on it is is so good, especially that now that it's hot. That's your. Is that your role? Is that your like when you're on tour, and you're on the on on the bus? Is that like your comfort snack? Mm, no no but it's in there it's, it's on the rider there. yeah all right cool there we go y'all i think i gotta go she about to perform i said everything <laughs> let's <Bye>. go <laughs>